Hello everyone, this is Dan from Design Plus Code and today I'm going to show you how we can add Lori animated icons or illustrations to HTML. So let's get started. So let's start in our code editor and over here I need to add a new HTML file. So I will just click over here and I will call the file index.html. Okay, perfect. To set up our HTML, we just need to put the exclamation point, enter, and the only thing I need to add over here is a small piece of code, which will help us to make this HTML compatible with the new Microsoft browser called Edge. Okay, there you go. Now, underneath the title, we will add some styling. So, I will type style, and inside the style, I will add an ID. So, I will type anim, I will open curly brackets, and actually you can call whatever you want. And I will give a max width of 800. Okay, so 800 pixels. And also we can give a margin. So let's give a margin of zero and auto. Perfect. Now we can save this. Also we can change the title of the document so we can put shape animation. Great. Now inside the body, we can add a div. So we can put div id equals, let's open quotes, and now let's call anim. Perfect. And we can close the div. Now, the other thing we need to do, we need to create a new JavaScript file. Let's click here, and we can name it script.js. Perfect. And now let's go back to index, but no worries, in the next few steps, we'll come back to script.js. So let's go back here, and now we can call our script. So let's type script source equals this open quotes, and let's select script.js. Okay, perfect. Now let's close this. Nice, so let's save this. Now let's go to shape.so. Over there, let's choose an animated illustration. So maybe this one, let's go to preview and I will change its color. And I will hit on download. Perfect. Let's go back to our code. So now, the only thing we need to do is just to copy our JSON file and put it in our code folder. Okay, perfect. Now, what we need to do is to have a Lodi player. To do so, let's go to After Effects and assuming that you already installed Body Moving, so we'll click on Window, let's go to Extensions and let's choose Body Moving. Perfect. A new window will pop up and hit on get the player. So what we are doing right now is to have a JavaScript file that will help us to play the Lodi animation. Then hit on get the player again. And let's save the JavaScript in our shape animation folder. Now going back to our code, as you can see, we have two new files, the JSON file and the Lodi JavaScript. I will go to script.js and I will add some code. Over here, I will create a new variable. So I will type var animation equals body moving dot load animation. I will open parentheses and then I will open curly brackets and I will put container column document dot get element by ID. Then parentheses, I will open single quotes and I will write anim. Don't forget the comma. And then I will write renderer column single quotes SVG comma, loop, because we want that our animation can loop, column, true, with comma, so we want also that our animation can autoplay. So let's go down and let's write autoplay, column, true, comma. And now we need to add the name of our JSON file. So let's write path, column, let's open single quotes, and let's just copy paste the name of our JSON file. Okay, good. Now, let's go back to index.html and we need to add to this HTML the loaded.js. So let's copy this piece of code and let's paste it above. And over there, the only thing we need to change is the script with loading instead. So now let's go to extensions and over there, let's look for live server. And this will help us to launch our site with the live reload feature. So let's click on install. Let's go back to the files. 
and let's right click and choose open with live server. Let's wait for a second and there you go. So with a few steps, you saw that it was so easy to preview your load animation. I can't wait to see how you will use this in your own website. So I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. If you didn't subscribe yet, subscribe to the channel. And if you have any questions, please put it in our comment section. I will see you in the next one. Bye.